with another video. We got some stocks that are squeezing. Look at Coinbase, pure squeeze. GameStop tried to do a squeeze. They're starting to break down. Very important level you got to watch out for. Carnival Cruise Line had a beautiful squeeze. Some of these are in. Some of these I sold all of the positions. Some of them I'm looking to buy. So we're going to go over that one as well. We're also going to go over Riot, okay, because the Riot just hit my target of $16 while I told you guys it would go. And then we're also going to talk about BKKT. Man, I cannot type. BKKT at the end, okay, at the end. But Coinbase is going to be first, so smash the like button, subscribe if you are new. If you want a second video today, all you got to do is get this video over 50 likes within two and a half hours. So it gives me time to make the second video so I can post another video for you guys, okay? So over 50 likes in two and a half hours. Make sure you like it. If you don't see it at 50 likes before the hours, just like it. It's free, okay? Now, first one is Coinbase, ticker symbol C-O-I-N. As you guys know, my 2025 price target on Coinbase was 140.40. I mean, it was 140. We have literally hit that already. We I only have about 25% left of my Coinbase shares. We bought down here, and we've been taking profit as it's been going up like I've been showing y'all. I can show y'all all the sales I've been doing on Coinbase in the next video, okay? So we've been profiting off of this big push-up. Now that we have had this kind of stall out in here for about three days, notice where we almost found support at 135 on Coinbase, right? That's where we're watching for support. We really don't want that to break because that's going to show a lot of strength. But you can see that upside is again a little, a little weaker. It also goes with Bitcoin. Because remember Bitcoin, I told y'all, once it breaks that 38,000, it's going to go to 45,000. It hasn't hit it just yet, but it's pretty close. So as it goes up in here, after we had this big run, we might need to see some type of pull down or maybe some type of stall out. Maybe like this. You see how it had that big run and Bitcoin kind of stalled out right around that like October 26th-ish area. And then if you look at the same price movements, Coinbase wasn't even moving yet, okay? It had this type of movement, but then it kind of stalled out right with Bitcoin, and then it had that sh just annihilated the market, okay? So watch the support. I'm not sure if I'm looking to buy more Coinbase just yet. I want to see what happens in this range because, yes, we are very vertical, but we could get a bigger down movement. So I want to watch support. I want to watch this target area, which is my old target. So what we can do is we can take that off. Let's, we have a resistance level at 150. I'm going to actually leave that up there, but we have another resistance at about 140. So now we are starting to get more resistance levels, which could sense more downward movement. But if we start to break that 140, that's going to be a sign that we're probably not going to be pulling down much lower. And we'll probably need to get some more shares, okay? Not just financial advice, of course, all educational purposes only. But right now, the main thing I'm looking out for is the resistance levels and when we break those. That's going to show the signs that we want to go higher. GameStop. GameStop is very stalled. This is also why I say don't be chasing no price. They also have earnings after market today. It's going to be very big for uh, GameStop. So I might update you guys in GameStop on the next video, depending on what it does after hours. But none of these levels matter now. Wait till after hours. Wait till the market opens in pre-market as well. And wait to see how the market opens tomorrow on GameStop. Because say it opens on after hours up here and pre-market is down here and then it goes back up normal hours. So just be careful of what it can do. But it does have earnings. So it, this is a support at 1450, but earnings is going to break that. It's not going to support that support level, but it might. But so, so far, I'm watching 1415 as support, and that's pretty much it. I kind of just want to see what it does for earnings. Carnival Cruise Lines, we actually sold all the position on Carnival Cruise Lines that we bought down here. I bought Carnival Cruise Lines down here for shares, and then it just went up pure short squeeze to the higher side. I've been telling you guys about this stock. Make sure you guys smash that like button. Been telling you about it. Told you guys it would go to 17. It literally hit my target, and now I'm looking for the next play. It is very vertical. Now I don't look to buy. I look to buy when it was pulling down, trading sideways. This is when you buy, but also there's earnings coming up on December 20th. So I might just wait till the earnings, but this was a purely short squeeze movement. Went straight up to our target in about four days, just not annihilated everything, okay? So for now, target is done, right? So this is how you trade. Like if you see a stock this vertical, Hit all your targets. The play went perfect. Make sure you join the team. First thing in that description, all the prices are here. Elite, elite year, lifetime memberships. Also, personal training where I teach you guys how to find these error levels, error entries, exit, so forth. Then, let's move the support. Now, the big thing, remember it had a vertical move here? And then it built support. That is what we're looking out for again. We are looking for support again. So, for now, I'm going to put support at the old target at $17. Okay? The big thing on Carnival Cruise Lines is when does it build that next support? That is what I'm looking to get in again. Pure, plank, blank, simple. Okay. That's Carnival Cruise Lines. Riot. Again, get this video over 50 likes within two and a half hours if you guys want a second video. Now, Riot. 
Target of sixteen dollars. I told you it would go. What was yesterday's high? Sixteen oh two. What do you see? Pull down. Target was hit. That's it. My new target now. I'm gonna push it up. I'm gonna push it up about eighteen dollars. Okay. New target eighteen dollars for Riot. But like I said, I want to see where that next support builds. Right now the support is around fourteen. I'll probably push it up to about fourteen fifty. But I kind of don't want to buy at these high prices, if I'm being honest. It needs some type of pull down. We need to see some type of support in here. It's been very vertical. I'm glad we got Coinbase because I'm not in a rush. I don't have FOMO of trying to play these other crypto stocks because we already played Coinbase of that big movement, right? You don't have to play every stock. Find one, find strategic, find a good entry, play that one, get your profit, and you're literally done. So still support, have a target up here. Not too much I see off of entry on Riot, but literally all these stocks are squeezing. And then we'll talk about BKKT. Now, this one. I want to see some more pull down. Okay. I want to see some more pull down. I want support right around 175. I actually wanted to hold support here. Now, this one does not, I repeat, does not have a clear target. But if we can get pulled down and it gets buying pressure at that support area and we start to push up, I will take it to about 220. Okay. That's where I'll take it to. So from here to here, that's about a 24% gain. And if it broke like 160, I'll probably cut it for a 9%. Uh, law so lose nine percent or gain 25 that's about what 9 18 almost a three to one risk reward that's how i play this one kind of put it at the end because it doesn't have such a big target like the other ones do but um yeah those are some of the stocks that are short squeezing in this stock you guys want me to add into the next video comment them down below smash that like button join the team first in the description for profit every week follow me on instagram will.knowledge and always remember no target based on advice so anything this for educational purposes only so do not trade anything you see or hear in the video catch you guys in the next one bye